Hey everybody, today's Wednesday, the 20th of April. But, when it's Wednesday, you know what that means. That means it's time for comics again. Alright, so there's not a lot of new number ones today. There's lots of twos, threes, fours, and three hundreds out there. So we're going to take a quick look at a couple of the new number ones, the ones that did squeak through for you today. Coming away from Boom Studios is the new Vampire Slayer. Move over, Buffy. There's a new Vampire Slayer in town. Check out what's going on in this, the new Vampire Slayer. While we're at it with new starts of new series featuring classic characters, check out Captain America Zero. Yes, it's a new Captain America series starting right here, right now. Pretty soon there will be a Steve Rogers and a Sam Wilson Captain America book, but right now, get in on the ground floor with issue zero. From Dark Horse, there's a new war crimes, war horror, guy who lives forever kind of comic book coming your way called The Collector. And this one is Collector Unit 731, issue one. Find out what's going on with this guy who has lived many lives. And in honor of today's holiday, the team that brought you Deadpool from Marvel a bunch of years back, Jerry Dugan, Brian Posehn, and Sky Kobush are teaming up once again for the secret history of the war on weed. <laughs> How and why the war on drugs in the 1980s wasn't so good with an action-packed story involving a character named Scotch McTiernan who's here to kick some ass and take names and maybe smoke some weed. Check it out, The Secret History of War on Weed. One shot. In the trades and hardcovers section of my video this week, we will take a look at a couple things. First off, coming your way is a new fabulous furry Freak Brothers collection. It's volume six in these Fantagraphics reprints. It's got this sweet die cut cover. Uh, the guys, those idiots, the fabulous furry Freak Brothers, they go on a globe trotting adventure and Fat Freddy's cat stays at home. So check this thing out. It's coming your way for $22.99 from Fantagraphics. DC Comics is bringing the infinite frontier. What happened after Dark Knight's death metal and all that stuff wrapped up? How, how and why is Flashpoint Batman running around in the regular DC universe and now he's back in the Flashpoint universe? All those answers are inside this hardcover. This thing collects Infinite Frontier 0 through 6 and then Infinite Frontier Special Issue 1. It's coming your way in hardcover form for $39.99. Don't miss this thing. It's a pretty fun little setup for what's to come in the DC universe. Jonathan Hickman wraps up his run on the X-Men with the X-Men Inferno hardcover. This thing collects the entire series and it's coming your way for $39.99. Wrap up Inferno. It's freaking bright orange, it's awesome. And add this to your collection of other Hickman-related X-Men. If you're a fan of African cuisine, you're gonna wanna add this one to your repertoire. It's the Official Wakandan cookbook. It's African cuisine inspired by uh, the Black Panther comics. So check this thing out, get some cooking going on, add this to your collection of cookbooks, and start making some pretty sweet and delicious African food. It's coming your way for $29.99. Stews and desserts, nice. Are you also a role-playing fan, not just a comic book fan? Do you like to play tabletop games? Well, the Marvel Multiverse role-playing game is here, and in this new rule book, you're given a chance to like give your feedback to Marvel. There's a part when after you, you know, either pick a pre-existing character or move on and create your own character or villain, you get to kind of give your feedback to Marvel and they're gonna incorporate it into the final, final edition of the game down the road. This is like a sweet beta test. So, can't miss checking this thing out for $9.99 and it comes with three different covers. I know all you guys like that Peach Momoko. She's got her own cover for it. The Marvel Multiverse role-playing game can be yours for 10 bucks. Get it on the ground floor. Tell them what you think. Make an awesome game. Play a great, play some great tabletop games. And I'd like to take one last second to remind everyone that the Philadelphia mask mandate is back into effect this week. And here at our old city location in Philadelphia, we're asking everyone to please wear a mask. If you can't wear a mask, we can do online shopping and have curbside service for you. It's kind of easy. We've, we've made it very easy for you to uh, shop without having to be in the store if need be. But if you do swing through, please remember your mask. Thanks, and we'll see you soon.
Let's flash back to the. Let's flash. Uh, <clears throat> let's flash back to the 80s when everyone was saying no. Everyone was just saying no, uh, and Nancy Reagan was doing terrible things. <laughs> hmm.